I had a friend once, the Basilisk, but she died a long time ago. I earned my freedom. You walk out on me. On all of us. <laughs> Fighting side by side, we were goddesses of the pit. That's enough. Deal with me. You have a problem with her. Deal with me. So, what is it that you want? Why shouldn't we rip you to pieces and feed you to the beast? <laughs> I'm just going to be direct with her. My patience wears thin. My, I need great warriors. My enemies in Westeros are powerful and bloodthirsty. Worse than your masters ever were. <sighs> need fearless soldiers to crush them. You think we're self -sorts? We don't fight other people's wars. We are pit fighters. Artists who paint in blood. That was yesterday. The fighting pits have been closed. You're all free now. Free to do what you want. Don't you see that? Yes, we are free. Why would we follow another? We don't have masters anymore. Why would we follow anyone well, else? Your way of life is over. You all excel at combat, but you know nothing until you've tasted the thrill of war. Waves of men crashing together. Blood and steel. In Westeros, they sing of our great warriors for thousands of years. Amaya, trust me. He's got enough gold for all of you. You want to lead pit fighters? You have to earn their respect first. We don't know who you are until we see you bleed. Alrighty then. I knew it was going to come down to this. How about the beach? Show me your best. Who's the best you've got? His name is Blood Song. He's vicious, fearless, fearless and fast. Oh shit! I've never seen him before. Take a good look now. He's the man who's going to kill your dad. Eh, I thought worse. And what do they call that? That scary one with the. Two axes and the skull tattoo back in lease. What was it? Pestilence? Plague? The Scourge. Right. The Scourge. Anyway, he's dead. Well, suppose I better get this. <sighs> so what are you supposed to be? With your little axe and your pretty blonde beard. Says the guy with the perm. Oh! <laughs> You have a dying wish? Look after kill Bloodsong for me. Will you at least kill Bloodsong? <laughs> uh, sure. <laughs> we'll use your queen's gold to get as far away from here as possible. Hey! I need those! We'll fight with the weapons we give you. Oh, alright, fine. Like our masters did. I kill no man because another orders me to. I kill a man because it pleases me. Let me show you how we dance in Marie. I kill to live. That's lovely. You know why I kill a man? So he's dead and I'm alive. Let's get this over with. Choose a weapon and try not to die. All right. Okay, okay. Where's the weapon? Where's... Uh, give me the sickle. Yeah. Come on, bitch. What a fucking dancer. 
Okay. Gonna down. Are you ready? He's a monk. This is gonna hurt. Ooh. Yours will be a beautiful death. Isn't that something you'd like to say? Chin showcase. Let the crowd go wanting. I think I can actually. Left, right. Oh. Q. E. Well, okay, okay. Another weapon, another weapon. Uh. Give me the fists. Boom. Oh shit! Left. Ha ha! E. Q. E. Running out of weapons. Give me the stump. E. Oh fuck. Would it help if I stood still? Maybe. Come on, baby boy. Q. Finish him. Finish him. Right on the fucking neck. Oh. Power of Q is with me. Come on, you fucking guy. Does Marines dry air burn your throat? Get up. Get up, you fuck. Westerosi! Don't hold back! Don't intend to! Look at this terrified boy! He fears his end! <laughs> Come on, Asher. Oh, come on. Got to spam Q again. Yep, there it goes. Spam and Q, spam and Q, spam and Q. I got it. Whew, oh, it's intense. Left. E. It's over. Finish him. Ah, uh, something tells me. Oh, is she impressed? I can't tell if she's impressed or upset. Entertainment fighting under someone else's rules. I won't hold you back. Fight with me, and there are no rules. If you've got the balls to follow me, we will set sail at dawn. And to those too craven to join me, to hell with you. All right. Oh, over here! Over here! 
right. Drop its head off. Oh, fuck. Go for the head. Oh shit. Uh, go for the leg. Oh, there's another one. Fire or torch? Uh, get the torch. Burn! So is gonna is uh, Finn gonna turn into an ice walker then? Certainly you've been here before. You looked rather confused when you came in, as if you didn't know where you were. I don't know what you mean, Your Grace. I'm told you know these chambers as well as anyone. You're quite the curiosity, aren't you? You profess to be loyal to the Crown, yet you're not very loyal to Lady Marjorie. Have I displeased you, Your Grace? I've heard things. I understand you've been quite busy. Tell me, do you consider yourself an honest, loyal handmaiden? One can never tell with you northern girls. Assuming an honest person exists in King's Landing. It only matters what you think, Your Grace. Don't try my patience. Okay. Insincerity will only make matters worse for you. I've done my best to keep an open mind about people like you. Yet, Lucan tells me you invited yourself to Tommen's coronation party. How exactly did that happen? It can't have been easy. I used a friend. I forced a friend to help me. <laughs> Is that right? Then you're not above using people to get what you want. Good. Why would you be so reckless as to risk your neck for what? It all seems rather careless, considering the consequences. For my family. My family is still very much at risk, Your Grace. It was crucial I attend. 